Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Virgo Sun, Moon and Rising Sign. Please remember to listen to your um, Sun, Moon and Rising Sign and the month of August again because we're in the third week of August. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is um, a positive, positive week and everything in our lives we should think positive. I want to thank you for all the wonderful message that you have left behind. Thank you for supporting my channels and thank you for being here again. It is a week of the tower. The energy of the tower is so weak and the zodiac energy vibration is also fire. So for you Virgos it's going to be a week of uh, stability in your life. Whatever is happening in this week is going to work out in a positive, positive endeavor. Whatever is um, happening, you have the energy vibration of the Ten of Wands in reverse. The Ten of Wands in reverse. So whatever the situation is in your life, whatever burdens that you have been going through, you have the Ten of Wands in reverse. And it's going to be extremely... Um, um, a, a week of changeability that is going to happen to you Virgos so it's going to be wonderful as I look at your week you have the crowning energies of the wheel of fortune um, you have the five of cups um, the nine of um, pentacles the wheel of fortune the nine of cups so the number nine energies and the number seven energies is going to play a significant role in the lives of you Virgos in this week which is going to be <clears throat> a very positive positive ones whenever a week is being crowned by the wheel of fortune which is uh, the element the four elements it is going to be wonderful because for each and every person your life will be touched in different ways the nine of coins is a positive energies and the nine of pentacles is also a positive energies and then we have the seven of swords um, whoever that was trying to get away with something it's uh, not going to happen and then we have the eight of coins and we have the seven of cups so what is happening is that um, uh, Tuesday uh, Tuesday and Wednesday Tuesday, Wednesday, and Saturday is going to be your best days. Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturdays is going to be your best days. Nine, seven, and nine, uh, 77, 99. Um, 97 and 79 is going to be your numbers for this week. Let's see what else is happening. For you, Virgos, there's going to be, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, okay. There's something that is very special that is going on here. Something very special. Something very special is going on here for you Virgos. Something extremely special is going on here for you Virgos. Number nine, keep on coming back. Um, you have... Um, uh, number five energies you have judgment you have eight another time so um, this is going to be good um, so this week for you Virgos is all about emotional um, fulfillment there is going to be a celebration with the wheel of fortune so it's going to be good so the number five number seven number nine number 55 uh, number 77 number 99 um number five seven nine so it's going to be positive on the first day of the week on monday you have the five of cups the five of cups is that you're thinking and you're looking forward this is a situation that you're not looking backwards you're thinking and you're looking forward you try you want to try to bring positive energies in your life so whatsoever is happening whatsoever you have lost you have um, um two cups standing okay so whatever the the loss was you still have something standing so this is going to be positive this is going to be wonderful whatever the energies are whatever the situation are you're going to see positive endeavors coming in your life and this is going to be 
a positive um, day even though that you have the energy of emotional loss of loss of something you still have something standing and this is going to be good so whoever you are out there understand that sometimes we lose things because we have to let them go so that new things come in our lives on Tuesday we have the energy vibration of the hurt so it's Tuesday is going to be a wonderful day and you have the nine of Pentacles and this is good whatever is happening in your life the energy of the nine of Pentacles is positive it is um, money coming in to you that you weren't expecting is gift of money coming in and this is going to be positive you have the six of swords so um, it's the end of a situation and this money is a payout is a payout this is a payout for a lot of people so whatever was happening there is going to be a payout of a situation something that was unjustly done to you there is going to be a payout coming in for you and this is going to be positive so um, as you look at the nine of Pentacles and the six of sword that means it's the end you are going to receive this money it's going to be a payout and then whatever the situation was it's going to finally come to an end which is extremely good whatever situation it is take the money and walk away if it was a court case which I'm not seeing here it can be a situation of people trying to get you know don't pay you didn't pay you the right amount and then um, all of a sudden they have to pay because um, of some legalities they have to pay on Wednesday the crowning of the week you have the energy vibration of the um, wheel of fortune which is a fire sign and it carries all four elements so this is going to be positive this is going to be a lot of celebration this is going to be good whatever the wheel of fortune is bringing is a lot of success and that is bringing money because with money you have a emotional balance and this is going to be a huge celebration so whatever the situation was um, that you have gone through the last seven years whatever situation that has been playing out in your life you are going to receive rewards that was kept away from you so the wheel of fortune is bringing you wonderful wonderful material um, situation money um, help love um, but it's money that was uh, with own from you and now it's been um, rewarded and you're going to have a huge celebration so go out go out people and celebrate celebrate uh, you know be grateful that uh, finally whatever the situation is uh, it's now over okay as we move on on Thursday it's going to also be a wonderful day for you because you have another nine of uh, cups and the nine of cups is you that your dreams your wishes and dreams are coming true whatever the situation is your wishes and dreams are coming true and your wishes and dreams are coming true because uh, someone of a cup sign um, the queen of cups uh, someone who is a Pisces a, a Pisces a cancer or a um, a Sagittar, um, a Scorpio will be helping you to resolve the situation and resolve it in a positive way. So, you know, understand that whatever the situation was uh, in your life, uh, um, your wishes and dreams are going to come true. And whoever this Nine of Cups person is, uh, go with her because she is going to help you to resolve whatever the situation was. Okay, so it's that sort of a thing that is plain now in your life and accept whatever it was you know um, at least that you you know whenever things like these happen and always say to people ask for help ask for um, help and it will come through on Friday you have the seven of cup the seven of uh, sword the energy of the seven of sword is that someone is trying to get away with something and it's not going to happen because you're going to be victorious and successful with this situation so what was happening on Friday someone was trying to get away with something it's not going to happen because you're going to be victorious and successful over whatever was happening because the energy of the chariot is a, um, a victory and a triumphant over whoever that was trying to steal something away from you or get get um, you know get rid of something you know trying to do something that was injustice and you're going to see that whatever the energy was you are going to be um, triumphant here over because the energy of the chariot comes in um, to show that whoever this person was that was trying to do something they're not going to get away with it and it's going to be good that it's going to be 
positive thing for you because you're going to be understanding that uh, um, whoever tried to do something it's not going to happen as we move forward we have the eight of coins um, a good day for you it is the energy vibration of the hurt energy which is good you are a Virgo and you have the eight of coins so you're working hard on Saturday and by working hard you're going to have a very 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 um, positive uh, um, academy that sort of a thing that people are going to see that you're doing um, the best that you can positive work and positive situation you're, you're working hard to bring this positive endeavor and uh, people are going to be judgmental but in a very nice and kind way so whatever is happening in this week uh, whatever has transpired in your life you you're going to see on Saturdays that people are going to be you know judgmental but yet still in a very positive way and this is going to be good on Sunday we have another seven the seven of cups and the seven of cups is here and this is good because whatever is happening um, a lot of new opportunities will be coming in and it will be you know a lot of people are going to be sending you messages email text messages uh, asking you to connect with them that sort of a thing and it's going to be very positive so whatever the seven of cups uh, it's going to be good ideas you're going to be cr very creative you're going to be wanting to do um, humanitarian work or that sort of a thing for some people you're going to be finding out something that is creative something that you can help uh, um, use to help uh, um, society and all and a lot of messages this could be text messages and uh, email messages will be coming inviting you um, invitations and that sort of a thing and um, if you're looking for a job on Saturday or Sunday you will receive a message of invitation so all the people who are looking for jobs in this week it's going to be a very positive weeks because a lot of um, doors of opportunities if you're looking for other opportunities in your life a lot of opportunities are going to be coming up a lot of people are going to want to connect with you a lot of people will be sending you messages and that sort of a thing so this is positive this is um, a wonderful energy to have um, the seven of cups because seven of cups is where you um, start to dream and manifest things in your life and they're going to come in in speed they're going to come in in speed because if you notice um, she's looking at this seven of cups so you will see that whatever that you are trying to manifest and trying to create uh, all of these stuff is going to come in at speed in your life and this is going to be positive so as we do a rundown of this week and this is very good for you Virgos to write down these number five seven and nine five seven and nine so we're going to um, look at this week this week is going to be a very positive week for you Virgos because we are having the wheel of fortune with celebration so your week is going to be a week of celebration because whatever is happening whenever the energy of the wheel of fortune comes in with a celebration it is saying to you whatever situation you are going through the burdens that you were carrying is now being released okay as we take a look at the first half of the week your um, focus in the first half of the week is uh, the nine of Pentacles the nine of Pentacles so whatever has happened you're going to be receiving that nine of Pentacles in the outcome because um, you had regrets over something whatever it was you had regrets but not all was lost um, you you had the regrets because of certain things that happened and the way certain people treated certain situation and behaved but not all is lost because you have the energy vibration of the working hard you still went on and you still go on and worked hard at it and you're out your end result is going to be the nine of Pentacles and this nine of Pentacles is going to be a positive positive um, situation that you have overcome whatever that was injustice to you as we look at the second week we have the energy vibration of the seven of cups which you have created things in your life and you have made things possible in your life and what you have seen is that you have seen that the energy vibration of uh, um, um, 
new ideas, new situation, a lot of mails, a lot of messages of invitation will be coming in. A lot of people are going to want to connect with you. And as you look forward, whatever that was happening, that someone was trying to steal something and get away, you are going to be victorious over the situation. Whoever, whatever it was, you're going to be extremely victorious um, over the situation. And the end of it is going to be the Nine of Cups, your wishes and dreams are coming true. So it's going to be a very positive week because again it's a week of celebration it's a week of uh, uh, your luck comes in and you're celebrating it's a positive week of your luck come in and you will be celebrating so this is wonderful with the energies of love there's a lot of energies of love because on Monday whatever the loss is uh, um, you know you can cope with it and on Thursday um, the, 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 the the situation is that uh, whatever you have lost something better is going to come in that place so and when I say something better is going to come in that place it's going to be extremely extremely good and on Sunday the energy of love comes back up with a lot of people trying to connect with you trying to send you messages trying to let you know how they feel about you there's a lot of invitation that will be coming in on Sunday for a lot of people um, if you're looking for work this week it's going to be an extreme positive week I'm working with the um, the um, the chakras card because everybody need to understand that your chakras it's very important and you have the third eye chakra this has been coming up a lot for a lot of people and you are the Virgos and you're an earth sign so I guess that's why the third eye chakra came up for you guys in this week it's going to be a positive positive energy whenever you open up your third eye you can see clearly you understand things better you understand where you are on your journey and where you are on your part so the third eye is here so call upon Archangel Raphael to touch open and activate your third eye chakra this is going to be extremely positive okay I'm using the funny cards uh, the Oracle F the E and let's see what they have for you they have hairball and I love airball because um, I was studying these cards because I, th I think they're so funny so I was studying these cards and airball is actually a very good card to have because um, airball is uh, Uche, small little tangel no big deal um, uh, <laughs> last thing you want to do is to get your uh, knickers in a knot it will all smooth out as soon as you stop take a big deep breath and realize it's time to end it over to the universe the dude <laughs> the dude to the uh, um, recruiter move aside so this is good because airball is so funny it says uchi mom a small little t um, tangle no big deal last um last thing you want to do is to get your knickers in a knot it will all smooth out as soon as you stop take a big deep breath and realize it's time to end it over to the universe the dude to the recur move aside so what it's saying to you is that whatever the situation that is going on in your life at this moment whatever the um, misunderstanding the whatever is going on move over and it over whatever the situation is on Monday that you have the um, the five of cups a loss you need to release the situation to the universe and call upon the universe and said I am tired of this I'm handing the situation all the situation that is going on around me with whatever situation I'm handing it over to you the dude so that you can um, release it heal it and release it and it will happen so this is a wonderful and that's why I use these funny cards because I think in each and every person life you should be able to um, have some fun and laugh sometimes because uh, we don't laugh anymore because uh, things and situation around us is so um, 
so unjust at times and as an earth person you take things really serious so um, this is a positive card the last card that I have is from the angel answers and I'm asking the angels um, to give the answers to the Virgo what they should know in this week what is the answer that the Virgos know whatever the situation is it's a no okay whatever the situation is it's a no and let's 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 look and see well why is it a no it is a no it is a no it is a no let's see and and these cards you know there's two no's okay okay this no because there's two nodes nodes in this deck and this no the response to your inquiry is a firm no you needn't worry though as you will see why this was the perfect answer as time goes by okay so whatever your question was the response to your inquiry is a firm no you didn't you needn't worry though as you will see why this was the perfect answer as time goes by I know okay so whatever is going on and I'm going to ask and see if I can see whatever is going on and uh, I'm asking the angels to show me why is it a no and I know sometimes you shouldn't go deeper to find out but why is it a no okay all right your last card was a no no because of um, the uh, conflicts that are going on and this is because of jealousy and there is going to come an end to it okay so whatever that you were asking about it the answer is no and why the answer is no is because of the jealousy the conflict this is conflicts whatever the conflicts was whatever the conflicts was there was conflicts it was huge conflicts no whatever the the, the 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 conflicts was it's all about jealousy and that is going to come to an end whatever it was it's going to come to an end okay so um, whatever your question was um, it's, it's better that uh, um, your outcomes is going to be the energy of the stars so it's going to be okay so whatever you were thinking about doing or you know whatever you were going about or whatever it was uh, the answer is no but and it's because of uh, the conflicts the jealousy and it's going to come to an end okay so the energy of the star is a positive one whatever the situation is the energy of the star is a positive one and this is good so I'm leaving you with a positive message you have the outcome of the star so whatever you were thinking or planning on doing it's better not to not at this moment as time goes by you will see why and <clears throat> this is going to be positive so again have a wonderful week thank you for being here and list please go back and listen to the monthly reading because this is the third week of the month and uh, um, have a wonderful day